Next, we're going to take a look at scenes. I'm going to click on the scenes option on the left, and you'll see I have two options. The first option on the left says students can only access websites you allow. Everything else will be blocked. And then on the right hand side, it says students can browse any website except what you've blocked. So you have two options to control what your students have access to. So I want to demonstrate how the blue side allowed websites work. If I want to create a link that only my students can access and I don't want them going to another website, I can choose to create a list. And let's say that website is uh, biomes.com. I'm going to grab. Oops. There we go. I'm just going to pick. Um, let's say I want them to only go to this specific website right here. I'm going to grab this by copying it. And then I'm going to go back to my scenes. And I'm going to choose create list. Give it a name. Then I'm going to click next. And this is where I'm going to paste in the web address and I'm going to search for it. It'll give you some options, but obviously the first one is the best option because that's the exact same website. I'm going to choose add. So now my students will only be able to go to that website. I only want them to have one tab, that tab open. So if you want to control how many tabs your students can open, you can click on the bottom right corner and you can make a choice up to seven tabs. I'm going to choose one because I only want that tab open. And when they go to GoGuardian, or excuse me, when I open GoGuardian scenes, I want them to automatically go to that website. So I'm going to click on this option right here. And so it's going to turn on. So when I turn this scene on, this website will automatically pop up on my students page and they will only be able to open one tab at a time. So I'm going to click save. And you'll see now I have two of them saved over here. The concept works exactly the same on the right hand side, only that they, these are websites that they can, um, students can browse any website except what you block. So whatever I put in here, it will be blocked. So if I do not want them going to a website that's social media or games or just anything that's distracting, this is a great place to add those in there and turn that scene on. So I'm going to demonstrate how to do that in my next video.